looking at my statement and sure enough somebody in Florida like there's the address and everything I don't know if it's a fraudulent address but they bought two plane tickets thank you for the food daddy you're welcome ohayo gozaimasu ohayo gozaimasu no 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 does it taste good ladies no. Yeah. Good morning. Oh snap! I didn't even realize when you put shelves up there. Yeah, I still can't find my sandals. <laughs> this morning, mom and I are gonna get our pedicure. Now we need to just make sure that she's free right now because I tried to set up an appointment. But this lady that we go to, like she's super chill and she never books appointments. So she's like, you have to call the morning of. My toes are making a statement. And I'm not talking about the shape of them, I'm talking about the color. <laughs> this place is so fun. It reminds me of, you know, um, the barber shop. You get your nails done and everybody just chats. <laughs> Fan the toes. What? Okay. Okay, go. Yeah, because you know, like, nothing especially Thomas gonna make the sandwiches. They don't have decent food. Um, well, they do. I think on the whole, Alaska area. Yeah, like they have like the Hawaiian food, but most likely we're gonna sit in the back because we got the kids. Hi. Bye. You know, when you have kids, they usually put the kids towards the back because uh, it's closer to the bathroom. Usually, by the time the food gets to us, like all the good food is taken. So, Mama's gonna make her delicious sandwiches. And even when we were little, you would make sandwiches on like road trips. Yeah. Mom made the best sandwiches. But you still wanna go to McDonald's. <laughs> JP, you remind me of Punky Brewster. I just have to put your hair in pigtails. Mommy, can You're I so see cute. my jacket? 13 miles, baby. I did plan on running a lot more than that, but I got a lot of stuff to do. Pack, gotta write a book. I'm writing a book right now, you guys. Chris here got some epic drone shots. Super epic. How was it today? It was actually really good. When I first started, I was just planning on doing a simple run, going slow, and then out of nowhere, the coffee kicked in. That's when I was just like. <laughs> How was that? What did you do? <laughs> there you go. Is it hot still? Just warm. See? It's hot. Minty can do it. Come here, boo. Okay, Minty. <gasps> oh, thank you, Minty. It's so hot. Okay, I think it worked. Uh, Did it work? Um, uh, it worked. What do you say to Minty? Thank you, Minty. Ha ha ha. Hi, Mommy. Mommy. Yeah, I'm not sure why Mama has a bunch of snowman plates. You were going out to dinner with Benji's family. It's his mom's birthday. I'm looking for a berry lip liner. I have one of those. Oh, here you go. I'm just gonna fill in the entire lip. This is a great way to keep your lipstick glossing long all throughout the day. I opened up one of my new palettes so that I have one in my makeup room and one in my bag. So we're going to do sultry. Actually, I'm going to mix sultry and fierce. I like that berry too. Mmm. Oh, it's all these lipsticks. By the way, Targets have been restocking the palettes. So if you haven't had your chance to get the palette, do that. Or you can get it guaranteed on stock online at Target.com or Pixie Beauty. So a few days ago, I noticed a fraudulent charge on on my PayPal. And luckily, like I love that PayPal does this. I got a text from PayPal saying that there was, I think it was like $1,600 taken out. Looking at my statement and sure enough, somebody 
in Florida. Like there's the address and everything. I don't know if it's a fraudulent address, but they bought two plane tickets and I just got email back from PayPal and American Airlines and they refunded all the money. But how scary is that? Like, you know, I, I, I guess if you don't have your alerts turned on or you don't check your statements often, then it's easy for people to steal money from you. And this has happened before, like where people hack into, oh my gosh, it happened a few years ago with um, my bank. I strongly, strongly urge you guys to turn on your alerts just to make sure if there's any suspicious activity, you're able to catch it right away. Because I think I caught it, um, I caught it within like 10 minutes of them taking my money and I could tell like they were trying to take more. Hopefully American Airlines, since they have that person's flight information, maybe they can investigate further into that because you know, you need your first and last name and ID to get on a plane. Anyways, just be careful out there. Only Benji. It's like you planned it. <laughs> I did because I didn't have enough time. At least he asked if everybody was yeah, okay right. with it. Yeah, <laughs> So what's special about this Dale Cutter hoodie? It's from Japan and I had it as a child. Is that your Snoopy one? Uh, no, Bugs Bunny. What's up, you think, Jim? It's kind of beautiful. Thank mom is gonna they love have, this. Um, it is steps. such a beautiful view of Seattle. What's this conversation? Jackets and jeans. I cannot fathom wearing a the, jacket The two jeans. young guys. <laughs> well, jackets the, and jeans. The jeans that my dad grew up with were Levi's. Oh, they have okay. These things called designer jeans now. <laughs> Is there a difference? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, I was greeted today by a fan. Oh, yeah. I walked out of the, uh, uh, out of the uh, exchange on base and she says, I know you. Okay. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> she had a baby. She says, Aren't you Judy's father in law? I says, Yes, wow. I love you. Aw. <laughs> this is such a beautiful dinner. The sun has already set, and they're playing the song from that movie. What movie? There's Grampy. <laughs> Hi, Edna. How you doing? <laughs> What's the song? This is the one with Hugh Jackman. Hugh Jackman and uh, yeah, well, it's just called Les Miserables. Juliana used to be obsessed with this song. Yeah, we have the most awesome server here, and we're like spouting out names of movies. <laughs> Ryan was what was it? Movies and authors. Movies and authors. So we said, can you make a La La Land cocktail? And, and that's Amy all said, we said. Make a Ryan Gosling in a glass. What if they just bring you a <laughs> tall glass of water? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's going to be, gonna be fun. Like Something fun? Something fun or romantic. <laughs> one of the two. Okay. <laughs> no, it's not going to have a lot of booze. No. Do you think it's going to be fruity? All right, Ryan Gosling. My Ryan Gosling. I won't know. It smells citrus. <laughs> I, I'm driving. Woo! Woo! Okay, mix all this. What is it? What is it? Uh, so in the cocktail is rye, cognac, a little bit of a violet liqueur here too. Thanks, Ryan Gosling. <laughs> <laughs> Relax the eyebrows. <laughs> the pianist downstairs is playing Bruno Mars right now. Nose hurts, you know. Nose is not fun. I got it. <laughs> 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 
Somehow I think that would work. I like to have 